Puzzle sign, chapter 22, problem number 34. And um, this problem is from section 5, which is Len's Law. So I just want to go over what Len's Law is so that we're all on the same page. So Len's Law provides a way to determine the polarity of an induced EMF. Len's Law is stated as follows. The induced EMF resulting from a change in magnetic flux has a polarity that leads to an induced current whose direction is such that the induced magnetic field opposes the original flux change. So this statement is a consequence of the law of conservation of energy. So knowing that, we can proceed with the problem. Um, so the drawing shows a straight wire carrying a current I. Above the wire is a rectangular loop that carries a resistor R. If the current I is decreasing in time, what is the direction of the induced current through the resistor R? Left to right or right to left? So I is decreasing in time. And they want to know what is the direction of the induced current through the resistor. So um, the magnetic flux is decreasing as the current decreases in time. And I concluded that the direction of the induced current is left to right. So um, I got this answer because um, at the location of the loop, the magnetic field produces, produced by the current I is directed in the direction into the page. So um, this can be verified by using the right hand rule number two. So the current is decreasing, so thus the magnetic field is decreasing as well. Therefore, the magnetic flux that penetrates the loop is decreasing. So according to Lenz's law, the induced EMF has a polarity that leads to an induced current whose direction is such that the, the induced magnetic field opposes this flux change. The induced magnetic field will oppose the decrease in flux by pointing into the page in the same direction as the field produces by I. So according to the right hand rule two, the induced current must flow clockwise around the loop in order to produce an induced field. So thus the current then flows from left to right through the resistor. Thank you.